Hi, uh, my name is Elena. I uh, work for a company that's about uh, 50 to 100 employees right now. Um, I am the employee experience coordinator here, and I would give Document 360 a five-star rating. We didn't really have a process in place, so we looked and we did our research and we compared it against uh, multiple other companies that could provide the same um, kind of software for our document needs and Document 360 not only had the best price, but they also had the most features and they could do what we needed um, in a very short amount of time as well. So we chose Document 360 um, because of the many features that they had for their um, document keeping and the way that we could set up our knowledge base so that it was easily accessible with multiple permission levels um, with several different groups that we needed a knowledge base for. We had our affiliates that needed to reference our resources and then we also had our internal employees and Document 360 was able to do both and keep those accesses very separate. They also had a lot of really great features that leveled up our documentation. We could input images really easily and then we also had um, they had a glossary function that really leveled up our documentation because it was easy for people to hover over the word and if they weren't familiar with it, then um, they could easily see the definition. Okay. Um, so getting started with Document 360, it was really easy to set up. They had a lot of tutorial videos as well. So whenever I had a question, it was easy to find the answer. They had uh, YouTube videos that we could go back and reference if we had become unfamiliar with the feature um, or if we just wanted to learn more about it and decide whether or not we wanted to implement that for the future. It was very quick to set up. I think it only took about um, like two to three weeks. Okay, so um, some advice that I would have for someone looking into Document 360 is really utilize the resources that they have. Their support team is really great at answering questions, so if you have any doubts, concerns, or questions up front, then you can have those answered really easily. And then I would also suggest uh, utilizing the how-to videos that they have ahead of time and really looking through those uh, before jumping straight into the software so you really have an understanding and a feel for how to get set up very quickly.